Hello peeps and today is Sunday and it is almost 10 and I am very tired but I am haven't quite decided what this video is going to be about. Hmm. I will get back to you guys in like five minutes. I'm back. So it is your girl Melinda and um, before we get started into this video, please, if you guys would like it, subscribe. There's a button down below. It's red, has the word subscribe on it. And um, please click it so you guys can, you know, get updates about my videos. And let's just get into the video. Yeah. All right. So this video will be about the anime that I personally love, anime and manga, because I have been doing a little bit of both. So, um, the first one is an anime that came out in like 2014. And they, it only has one season, unfortunately. I don't know why they discontinued it. I will make, I'll figure this out later. But it's called Black Bullet. And it's basically about, there's like this virus called Gastrea. And it's like invading. It's, it's a virus. It kills people. And then there are these children who are born with the virus. And they're called cursed children. So the whole thing is they're trying to defeat the virus. And the only way to do that is with a Varanium silver. Or, or, or like a metal called Varanium. It was really good. I don't know why they discontinued it. I will... I'm probably going to go check to see if the manga is out. And that is number one on my list. Oh, well, these aren't in any particular order. It's just, I'm just throwing this out there. But that is number one on this list so far. Next anime is Attack on Titan. Or for those more cultural people, Shingeki no Kyojin. And, um, Jesus fucking Christ, guys. This anime... I mean, at first, it's like kind of boring, but like it gets better and better each episode. Right now, there's two seasons and I am, I stopped season one. I finished season one and started reading the manga and then I was like, oh, fuck. Okay. Started season two, finished it, and then I caught up on the manga and everything is mind-blowing. You guys, you guys seriously need to watch it. Watch it or read the manga. I don't care. Just one or the other because you guys won't regret watching this anime or reading the manga or both. I tried not to be so, you know, mainstream about this list. But I ended up doing it. I have like three or four, possibly five or six mainstream animes. And I'll just list them right now. The first one is Naruto and Naruto Shippuden. And One Piece and um, Shokugeki no Soma or for those other people, Food Wars and um, A Silent Voice and Your Name. The first three are like series and the last two are movies. But let's see. Let's start off with um, Naruto. OG anime. You won't. It's like so old but I never ever regretted watching it and um i haven't watched borto which is about naruto's son i kind of don't want to because what i saw of it he's a whiny unappreciative little piece of shit i'm not afraid to say it and then one piece oh my god it's guys i think there's something like 800 episodes but i'm caught up on the manga i have not watched the anime in a long time and like since like last semester so it's been a few months um also great there's some people out there who are like eh, Naruto's alright and eh, One Piece is alright this is my opinion I freaking love these I've never read the manga for Naruto I just watched it straight up watched it but my One Piece once I caught up on One Piece on the anime I was like oh, I can't wait I can't wait so I started reading it I was never really a manga person until One Piece and then I was like oh I'll just upcome and I did and I don't regret it the next one is Shokugeki. They have two seasons out and um, it's literally food porn. I kid you not. Like 
they'll cook something up and as soon as if it tastes like freaking amazing it'll, it's like they're having an orgasm which is exactly what they want which is basically food porn then right now they have two seasons out and the third season is coming out in october yes see guys this october and i'm currently caught up on the manga too so obviously i'm way ahead of the anime and <laughs> You guys should definitely watch it because it's pretty good, if, especially if you're a foodie like me or you just like to eat food like me. And the other two is A Silent Voice and Your Name. They're both movies. They're both so good, you guys. Like, I'm a very emotional person, but this, I'm pretty sure if, even if you're not emotional, this will get you in your feels. A Silent Voice is basically about a deaf girl and a boy. And I can't say any more about that because I'll ruin it for you guys. And your name is basically a girl who wishes she was a boy living in Tokyo. <sighs> and there was a boy who wishes he was like, you know, not living in Tokyo. And it's just so good, you guys. These are my mainstream anime that you guys should probably watch because they are so good. And it might just get you guys into this fandom. Um, another one that I really like that I just decided to watch because I was at my sister's house and she had Netflix and it's called The Devil is a Part-Timer. It's a, it's kind of weird, but I don't know. I liked it. Um, it's the devil. He, you know, they live in a different world. They come to the human world. They end up in Japan and, um, they basically live in Japan as normal people and it's just, it's pretty funny you guys it's a pretty pretty funny anime i just kind of would hate how it ends um and a last one that i highly recommend is erased oh my god you guys <laughs> it's it's kind of like a mystery kind of deal but um I was able to call it like six episodes in. I'm pretty fucking good at this shit. Like figuring out the plot twist. I was able to figure it out. But there's this boy. And um, he ends up dying I believe. And he like gets transported back in time. To when he was in elementary school. And um, ends up he has to figure out what's happening to his one of his schoolmates. <laughs> watch it you guys won't regret it it's pretty short i think it's like 13 14 episodes i definitely 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 recommend that you guys watch this i have as you guys know i am definitely a huge anime fan huge manga fan so is my boyfriend i'm so excited about i'm just like that's one of the things i love about our relationships that we can talk about anime um another one that i really like is called gate it's pretty, it's interesting because it goes it has like this sci-fi kind of deal, futuristic kind of thing, and well no not really it's like a Japanese military against um, fantasy world like for some reason they just both clash and it's and it works you guys it works that's those like the only ones I can come up with like in those five five minutes for me thinking because. This is honestly a video on a whim that I did not think about, but definitely you guys should check it out. Check out all these anime. Yeah, seriously guys. Just give each of them one chance and you guys won't regret it. And that is all you guys that I have for this episode. Um, I might make up another episode with more anime. I don't know click the like button comment down below i don't know but this is the end and i hope you guys enjoy this i'm like very quiet i'm very enthusiastic actually about this epi um, episode this youtube video but i'm trying not to talk so loud because it's 10 p.m and see that door back there that's a fake that's a door my brother can hear me so i'm trying to be really quiet but you guys Please give my love a chance. My love of anime, my love of manga, please give it a chance. And honestly, you guys probably won't regret it. If you guys do regret it, just tell me and I'll be like, oh, okay. Because anime is not for everyone, you know? 
So please like this video if you guys did and um, please subscribe and comment down below anything else, anything you guys want to watch. And I will see you guys later this week. Laters peeps.